Hello everyone and welcome to iBasiac. Well, it's not often that I disturb you so early on a Wednesday morning, but this is no normal Wednesday. No sorry, Barb. This is a very special Wednesday because today's the day that one of my biggest fans, so I'm told, turns five years old. Yes, I'm talking to you, Thomas. You're five years old today. Happy birthday. I hope you have a lovely day. Hopefully you'll be getting a party later on, perhaps, and I hope you've got lots of lovely presents. Well, I hear that you like vacuum cleaners. I like them as well. As you can see, I'm surrounded by them. I've got them out specially for you to do this little video. And I've been talking to some very important people who tell me that uh, you've got, you're a little bit uh, interested, aren't you, in pre- and post-motor filters on a vacuum. I often show those on my video, don't I? Now, do you know the difference? I'm sure you do, you're five years old. Do you know the difference between a pre and a post motor filter? Yes, that, yes, you're, you're very correct. Now, if, if you didn't hear Thomas telling me, Thomas knows that a pre motor filter comes before the motor and a post motor filter comes after the motor. It's always very important to get them right. You don't want to be mixing those up, do you? I understand you like crevice tools as well. I think you've probably seen some of my videos where I've shown you some very little tiny crevice tools. They're no good, are they? You can't get in all your nooks and crannies. No, you need a great big long crevice tool. And I meant to get you one to, uh, to show you. I've got one somewhere, but I couldn't find it. I'm sorry, but I do have one that fits this Miele. This is a Miele. It's not a cat and dog. I know you like the Miele cat and dog. This is just a, a regular sort of Miele. But I do have a, a very long extension uh, crevice tool. It's about that long. So that yeah, gets right down by the side of my fridge where lots of nasty bits and pieces tend to gather. Well, I think that's about it. Just a quick video for you. Um, I don't know if you're interested in, in any of these vacuum cleaners. Um, I've got James here, look. He's... Uh, I haven't done, again, I'm naughty boy, slap my hand. I haven't done a video of James yet, but I will be very soon, as well as the Harry video. I'll be doing a demo of the pneumatic Harry. Uh, well, I've done a demo of this little Dyson. Just had this out and uh, been clearing up my breakfast crumbs with it. Very handy for that. Uh, oh, you won't have seen this, Thomas. Look at this one. This is quite new. Look at that. This is a little Oric. It's an Oric. XL canister vacuum you can wear on your shoulder. So I'll be showing you that later. Not today, it'll be quite a while until I get to that one, but it will be coming up soon. So uh, I hope you uh, will enjoy that. What else have we got? Well, actually, what I will show you is this, look. Now this is, this is coming up very soon. In fact, for, for Thomas and for everyone else watching, this one's coming up today at five. So I know some of you may be thinking, Ah, oh, well he's done a video for Thomas, what about us lot? Aren't we going to get a video at 5pm? Well of course you are, this is an extra special video I've made specially for Thomas, but for all you other viewers and subscribers and VAC fans, don't worry, because tune in at 5pm and you will see me unboxing, bit of a spoiler, so look away if you don't want to know, block your ears if you don't want to know what I'm going to unbox at 5, but it's going to be this! Ooh. Here we go. Another AEG. Whoops, a daisy. It's falling all over the place. Oh dear, my. Uh, what's happened there? I had some lovely Hoover adverts on in the background and they've finished. They can't have finished already. Have I been speaking for that long? I get carried away. This is coming up the AEG Ultra One. It's uh, a lovely cleaner and shh, it's whisper, whisper quiet. In fact, it's the quietest vacuum cleaner I've used, modern vacuum cleaner. So tune in at 5pm, Thomas and everyone else, and you'll see me unboxing this, giving it my first look, and uh, I'll be having a quick go of it, but uh, the full demo for this, of course, will follow, along with all the other demo videos that I've got to do. There's a long, long list. I hope you'll be patient with me, because uh, it does take quite a while to make all these videos. Um, I don't know if we can see. Yeah, oh, it's just there. This came recently too. Uh, another vintage vacuum. This is an Electrolux Twin Turbo. 
Needs a few parts, it needs a new belt and filters and stuff, but it's not too bad. The unboxing and demo will be coming out for that. Just off camera, you can't see it, is my Hoover Turbo Light. Um, you've seen the unboxing for that, but uh, I'll be doing the demo of that too. Ooh, oh dear. Oh, it's too early in the morning for me. Um, I've just got, I've got this out. I don't know if I'll do anything with this. I was going to pack it away. You haven't seen this for a while, have you? Ooh, Hoover the one. I've done uh, a demo of this a while ago and things, but uh, and just behind, ooh, you won't have seen this. I think you might have seen this on my Facebook. No, you haven't actually. On my Facebook page, I tend to show photos of new vacuums coming up. I don't know if you've seen my Facebook page, Thomas, but um, I know your, your dad has seen it, so I think he might show you some of the things on my Facebook page. But um, I don't think I've shown you yet, but can we just see there? I've actually managed to get myself a Hoover Turbo Master, another one, Hoover Turbo Master Electronic Total System. So that's coming up. So I've got to crack on and start doing some more demo videos. In fact, I'm hoping, fingers crossed, that I'll be doing a demo of the James that should be coming up on Friday. So don't forget, later on today at 5 p.m. you'll see the unboxing of the AEG Ultra One. And as long as I've managed to do it in time, I'll be actually, finally, I know a lot of you have been waiting for this one, I'll finally be doing a demo of James, getting out my bag of filth and uh, giving James a right good test. He's very full actually. I have been using him quite a lot after my other demos because I use James to clean up after I've tested other vacuums. So he's a, a very good boy is James. You'll be seeing James and you'll be seeing lots more. There's so much to come. I don't know where they're going to fit the time in. Last thing to show you in this video, I'll be doing quite a few uh, other toy vacuum cleaners. This is one I found in my mum's loft. Well, I didn't find it. I put it there, but uh, I came across it as I was uh, hiding some more vacuum cleaners <laughs> at my mum's house. Unfortunately, her loft is full to bursting. But I saw this and thought, oh, well, I've not shown uh, my viewers this. So we'll be doing a, a demo of this as well. Plus, I've got a couple of Dyson toy vacuums. And there's, there's absolutely tons and tons of stuff coming up. But... When it comes up, I can't tell you, but it will be coming up soon, as soon as I can. So anyway, that's it. A bit longer than I expected, but happy birthday, Thomas. Um, I'm glad you like my videos. And um, I know you tried to do me a little video, didn't you? But your daddy hasn't managed to work out how to send it to me. So perhaps he'll be able to uh, put his thinking cap on and we'll work out a way for me to see the little video you've made. I believe you've made a little video for me, so that will be very nice if I can get to see it. But if not, don't worry. I know, I know you like my vacuums and uh, hopefully you've got a vacuum today for your birthday, perhaps. Who knows? Anyway, I'm sure your daddy will tell me what you've got today and if you watch this video and if you liked it. So um, to me, it's a big thumbs up to Thomas on his fifth birthday and for all you other VAC fans, don't forget, tune in at 5pm for the new unboxing. So until then, it's goodbye from me. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all very, very soon.